Bevels by Andrew Buckle. This tutorial I'm going to show you how you can quickly use bevels and use them with painting tools. Now first thing to do, just quickly create a document. Just go here to new and I'm just going to go for content, make sure there's some layers, so use that and then create. Then you just go over here to the layers. What you can do then, just see you've got four layers, just go over here to the freehand brush tool, go to the settings, Oops, one more. set pixels and set the diameter etc as required of course you could use other brush strokes as well you don't have to use that one you can use sketch bristle whatever but i'm just going to use brush strokes and then make certain for that layer just go to layer layer style and then go to bevel you can look down the list to actually see bevel there's bevel so select that and certain make certain the depth I'm going to go for 100%, go for a size, change the angle if you want, altitude maybe 60, 70, and then of course you can also modify the glass contour if you want, and click OK, and then you can paint, depending obviously on the actual brush, as you can see there, you've got a three dimensional bevel brush as you paint very quickly, and of course what you can do, because you've got multiple layers, you can just go to that one, and then you can say layer, layer style. And again, you can then go over here and again select bevel and maybe vary. So you don't actually have to go with the same setting. You can go for maybe a higher size, click OK, and maybe change the color, go for green, and then apply. And of course, depending on how fast it's working your machine, obviously when it's doing a video recording, it never goes as fast as actually when you're actually painting. But yes, you can paint very quickly just using this to create some interesting three-dimensional bevel-like paintings in Critter. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you very much.